Brian, for you also in your role, where do you see your role in helping Australia's economic recovery? Multifaceted. I mean, I have some of the best economists in the country, and part of it is just figuring out how on earth do we go through and create the programs that are going to connect not just to a small segment of the population, but to the entirety of the population. And so there's a whole range, including lots of humanities research and understanding how people think and work. There's a lot to do with the economics research of figuring out how to efficiently push things, stimulus packages through that then, you know, have added on effects of increased employment, additional investment, uh, increased productivity, and all those things. So really important on that side. But then on the other side, we have the issues of creating the new com companies. So, you know, I'm really focusing on making sure I provide every opportunity for my students and my staff who have an idea and want to transform it into a company or an idea at an existing company, that we make that easy. We allow them to you know, take three years off the university. We provide seed funding. We do anything we can to make them and Australia rich. I don't worry too much about the university trying to get its claws over that money because the experience from the U.S. is when you make your students, your staff, or companies rich, they always actually give back. So really taking that approach as well. And then there's all these things in the social good space. For example, we're doing... Uh, a, uh, a project with Optus, Mindaroo is involved as well, and probably a bunch of other groups over time to stop Australian bushfires, you know, as soon as they happen. So we can detect them and put them out in 15 minutes before they become hectare stuff. So that's also something we can do. And having lived through, uh, you know, a horrific January here in Canberra, where we had to close the campus for six days and the untold damage to the economy done, being able to do those types of things that don't explicitly make money, but they make Australia a much better place to live, really important. And we're doing everything from next generation uh, renewables, uh, getting it so we can integrate those renewables into the grid, creating green steel, green aluminium, uh, you know, how do we go through and get rare earths, you name it, we're working on it. And there, it's so many things we could go going in a half hour, I'd still be going.